Yeah, and this vlog starts with trash. <laughs> and I'm going to, to Odessa now, I'm going to Ukraine again, again. I'm going just to Ukraine all the time. <laughs> but yeah, it's the first time for me to go into, to Ukraine, I mean to Odessa, not Ukraine. And um, yeah, I mean, I have like uh, the opportunity to make a, a, like a very cheap travel because every time you go there in Ukraine, it's like very, very cheap. I did this like really last minute. So I found like a place for 4 euro per night and I'm just basically going to see how it is, if it is uh, really that bad or if it is okay or whatever. Yep, so 4 euro per night for... I just arrived in Odessa and uh, I'm going to the hostel so I'm just going to check in now and see how the whole thing look in the end for 4 euro per night I think it should I mean I don't have a lot of expectation to be honest so I'm going to enter in the cheap hostel now and uh, let's see how is it So, I just arrived in the hostel and uh, the hostel was like uh, not very proper to be honest but like they were super welcoming and they really tried to speak in English with me which was like very kind from, from them because like it was very hard for them but to be honest I would have better I would have had better time speaking with them in Russian <laughs> But it was already very uh, cool from them. Uh, just one point, really, that I'm, I'm not very like into it. It's the fact that there is a lot of children in the the hostel, so it's not the kind of hostel I like a lot. Like they don't have like a lot of tourists, or at least there is a lot of uh, local here. Well, just one more thing before I go to bed. I just pay my meal and my meal is like I think the cheapest from like it, it's really a video all about like cheap thing <laughs> but uh, it's like um, 50 50 uh, grivian and uh, this is like maybe one euro one euro 70 something like this this is my bread two bananas this kind of things uh, there is like mushroom inside and stuff like that a bottle of water, of course, because like here you can't uh, really drink the 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 water co uh, from the sink. The tape water is uh, going to intoxicate you, so <laughs> please do not do this. So far in the supermarket, like everybody was smiling. Like I don't know, like it's almost like night. It's almost like midnight, and everybody's smiling. Like, mm -hmm. <laughs> like <laughs> it's not like in Kiev, but yeah, and we like it. We like it, of course. What the fuck just happened? Well, I'm going to tell you what just happened. A guy just uh, just fall, fall, fell asleep like with the music on, and uh, I just couldn't sleep. And I didn't want to wake him up because, like, my point is not actually to start a conflict with someone. Uh, because I saw like a lot of uh, video on the internet of uh, vloggers who have like very bad experience and how filming it and everything. That's not really my point. I really just want to make like a video to about like uh, some stuff and uh, this guy would have pissed me off like right away. Seriously, like I was really, you know, when I'm not sleeping, everything can go wrong like super fast during me. So <laughs> I really don't want to make like this trip a uh, bad experience. So how <laughs> oh, <laughs> I almost got run over just because like I just passed like when it was like green but you know like <laughs> well whatever 
not just this was wrong like the whole hotel was like a recollection of uh, oh, bullshit like uh, it was like very dirty sorry that i don't have like images to really show you but everything was dirty as fuck uh, in the room it was smelling super bad there were like a, a kid in the room so yeah another thing like i'm telling you like there is a kid in my room and the mother what is doing the mother she's like at 3 a.m like drinking vodka uh, during uh, i don't know now it's really the first time that i'm leaving like an hostel like during the middle of the night to find another one like i already slept in other hostels <laughs> while i was in a hostel but that was like completely different um, when i went to the kitchen there were people uh, sleeping in the kitchen <laughs> They were asking for silence, like what? <laughs> in my room it was like almost like a, like a disco club and in the kitchen it has to be super silent. And secondly, like the receptionist wasn't there and some people were trying to get in, <laughs> in the building uh, to, to, to get back to the hostel. So, first attempt is a failure. The guy told me that there were like no bed free, so now I'm kind of scared because I kind of expecting the same from the other hostel which is just behind. So I'm going to try to see because uh, right now it's like a 3 a.m. something. <laughs> so yeah, you see my point. I want to sleep. <laughs> So, what happened? What happened is that I found like uh, the second hostel was like had, had like uh, a place to sleep. So our, I stayed there and uh, it was okay, but uh, it was also like a very big room, like 10 people, it was the same. And uh, so there was someone snoring again, so I wasn't like, I didn't sleep much, like I slept maybe like uh, not much, like three hours roughly. There was also someone who like forgot to turn off the, its alarm and left the room and leaving the, the phone in it. So at some point like I took his phone and I, and I shut the, the alarm down. I mean the, the, the hostel was very, was way much better actually. It was like modern and everything, very clean. It was basically quite interesting to do this experience because I think that for myself I would never have tried to go into this first hostel. So now I'm sure I, I have no reason to go there anymore, <laughs> no reason at all, since uh, what happened. I don't understand why there is all the ton limousines like this. This is like a memorial for the people uh, who died, uh, I think, in the World War. I have no idea actually, I have to check that out. But I think it's more like in general, I'm not sure. People from Odessa. And let's see, on the other side there is like a beautiful building. Well, it turns out this is like an opera theater, so it's, uh, it's gorgeous. Uh, yes, I know, I know. <laughs> I know that over here there is somewhere uh, Crimea, but I don't know where is it exactly. I don't see it. I don't see the cross from here. It's really great looking. Okay. I like it. Yeah, make the show for me. Idi, idi kamne. Тики 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 тики. Ты не хочешь играть со мной, нет? Скат is like following me, but at the same time, <laughs> following me, but at the same time is like scared every time like there is like a, a, a very small noise. Oh, he's here.
Oh my god, I didn't see that actually there is like a lot of cats just behind. I don't know, like people are all the time talking to me, I don't understand them. Like I understood like the word that she told me. But I don't understand what uh, does it mean actually, like because I know the words, but I don't know somehow, like in this context. And it's very cute. Toy for him, my string to play with. Influencer, influencer over here, taking pictures of themselves in the in the wood. Wow, so I arrived like in the other hostel for tonight and um, it's a really com a complete different experience. Like it's almost the same price, it's maybe like a little bit more expensive here. I would say maybe here I paid like uh, 200 krivnias and yesterday I paid 216, uh, uh, so it's maybe twice more expensive, but I am in a different kind of room. Here there's only f uh, four beds. And uh, in the other one, there were 10, 10, 10 beds. It's completely different and it's also logical that it's more expensive. So in the end, like the difference is not much and uh, it's really much better. Like the, the receptionist was really, really nice. She was like super um, hospitable, friendly. So it was like very, made me a good impression of the hostel. Like it's kind of a hostel experience uh, video. I'm kind of uh, really understanding like how much is really important to actually pay like a minimum to have like at least a good sleep because like so far I never had like a such a bad experience as it, as it was uh, yesterday. This room is very nice. It's, there is a lot of uh, spaces. Look, there is even like um, air conditioning. So if you want to come in the summer, that's great. No, well, everything is cool. Everything is cool. So yeah, it's very important. Like it, it can change. Like definitely, you you stay in the city, and your whole experience. Uh, if you have like a bad experience with your hostel or uh, any accommodation you're staying, because like having a bad experience with your accommodation is not just from hostel. It can happen in hotel and also in Airbnb. Oh, ooh. <laughs> I mean no, uh, it's uh, it's it's a great hostel and I'm happy and I think that I won't have much trouble this night. That's is verdam cloud. No, yeah, thank you. And we send off Deutsch to reden and they hold all the clap. Nothing seems the same, always on the go now, never seem to slow down. You've been playing games, you don't pick up the phone now, when you know I'm never home now. Tell me when am I, when am I gonna see you, cause I've been missing your body right beside me. Tell me when am I, when am I gonna see you. You are actually listening to the kind of Anaconda song uh, of Nicki Minaj, but uh, from like an Ukrainian artist. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of like comparable uh, music, I would, I would say. <laughs> So yeah, for me, like uh, Odessa now it's over because tomorrow I will just go back to Berlin and uh, yeah, the vacation is over. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed the video, uh, just uh, like and subscribe and uh, I will be very pleased to answer your question or anything. And uh, if you have any idea for a new video, just tell me, I will be super glad about it. And uh, yeah, so see you in another video in another city. Ciao! Wait a minute.